it is uh, Thursday night. I have three miles on the plan tonight. It started pouring approximately six minutes before I left work. So I don't know what we're gonna do here. My guard is looking nice though. Check that out. Looking pretty good. But yeah. I'm gonna check the radar. Last I checked it, it said 7.15, it's gonna slow down. I can run in the rain as long as it's not storming. I don't really want to, but I can do it. So we'll see what the radar says. Update, here's the radar. Is it now? Yeah, it's not looking good. Ooh. Yeah, it's not gonna stop raining until 10, 13 p.m., maybe one tick closer than that. So I have to make a decision. Am I gonna tough it out? We are gonna get out of the lake dark green when, oh, not till eight. I'm just gonna have to fucking tough it out. Oh my goodness. If I hadn't waited until the last minute, I wouldn't be in this situation. I have no one to blame but myself. And Layla Grace. Oh my God, you're so cute. Look at you sniffing the air. Oh my goodness, you're so perfect. Yes, you are. Got the whole park to myself. We're coming up on sundown in the next half hour or so. And it's a little, it's a little spooky. But I'm almost done. I got less than a mile to go. Saturday night I'm home from work and I should just be carb loading and relaxing but it turns out I signed up for the 5k and I forgot about it so here is my box by the way this is the move Pittsburgh marathon box there's my bib for what I'm about to go out and run and this is my bib for the marathon tomorrow we are gonna wear our bibs it's virtual but we're gonna wear it and a whole bunch of other goodies. We got some honey stinger, honey stinger waffles, which are my fave. I haven't tried the chocolate before. I always get the vanilla or the strawberry. So this will be nice to try. Smiley cookies from Eaton Park. I hope these haven't been in here too long because I don't know how long it took for them to ship these to us. <laughs> um, some coupons for some stuff. Some noon, I'm not a fan of noon. I don't know if I'll eat those or not. I might give them to my friend Kara, who is a new ambassador. Then we got the good stuff. We got our shirts in here. I guess I have this in the kitchen, that's the sink. Oh, that's my 5K shirt. These are, oh, they're t-shirts this year. Oh, geez. Well, probably not gonna keep that then. I like the long sleeve tech shirts, but. So there's that. I guess I can't put this on until after, so we'll show that after. Then, we have, this is the, oh, okay. So the marathon one is long sleeve. <laughs> okay. Yeah, big sporting good Pittsburgh marathon. This will be my first Pittsburgh marathon. I've only done the half before. And then the two medals in here. So the one, preview. This is my marathon model for tomorrow. Pretty cool. 
a nice looking fort pit bridge, which we run all the time and hate. And then for doing both the 5K and I, I guess I signed up for this whenever this was supposed to be. Whoa, rowdy. I signed up for this when this was supposed to be. Whoa. Um, <laughs> in person. So I think that's why the steel challenge is when you do the 5K on Saturday and then you do the marathon or the half on Sunday, you get this extra steel challenge medal. So can't wear this one yet. Can't wear this one yet. Can almost wear the other one. But then the big money item in this thing is the jacket, the finisher's jacket. Oh, that's pretty sweet. It says 26.2 on it. That's nice. It's got a hood. Moisture wicking, like good quality. Okay. I don't really have any like good quality jackets like this for running, so nice. Pretty cool. So I'm off to go run that 5K right now. What are you doing? Is this your favorite? Whoa. Whoa. Do you love it? You love it. It matches your fur. You're so perfect. Winnie. It's race day. I slept like garbage. My allergies are really shit this morning and I sound like I'm losing my voice. And I'm standing in my kitchen eating a calzone chicken bite because this is the life that I lead. Yeah. Race is about to begin. We have our directions. We have the mic squad, one mic, one mic. We got them there to back us up throughout this. Here's everybody, woo, marathon day. Woo! Oh, hold on. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Marathon day! Woo! We're gonna do this. First bridge of the day. The worst bridge of the day. It's kind of nice to get this over with fast, yeah, huh? Yeah. Yep. Castle. Castle Ninch Street. We made it halfway. Here's our halfway savior, Christy. <laughs> the best! We should run so it looks like we're running. <laughs> hey Carla! Check out these balls of ice cream! Hi you! Molly came to see us! Hey! How's it going? Whee! Next aid station! Woo! Oh man! Oh, that feels so good! Yes! Look at all the people out! Look at our happy city! Hello, Pittsburgh! It's a great day to run a marathon. Someone's got a drone. All right, down we go into Station Square. Oh my God, my feeties. My feet too. <laughs> I'm starving. Yeah. Yeah.
headed to dinner right now at this place called Spirits and Tales where we went for our anniversary a couple years ago. It is so good. Running just a couple minutes late because as you saw after the marathon, we hung out and had some beverages and some snacks under the bridge where our cars were parked. And so we were just like a little bit crunch for time. Normally I like to take a nice, nice long nap after a marathon and uh, that didn't happen. I also do not have lipstick on. My lips are just this chapped because I forgot to put chapstick on before running 26 miles today. So I am super excited because this restaurant is amazing. Last time we went there, it was so good. So it should be a nice night. And then I'm gonna come home and go to bed. Also, I should point out that I did, in fact, do makeup for the first time. I did makeup once or twice on vacation and that was it. But uh, yeah, it's getting real because I did makeup for dinner. I was gonna wear my medal, but I am sunburned on the back of my neck despite applying sunscreen twice during the race today. So I, yeah, I'm not gonna wear my medal. But I do have a necklace on, it's not gonna bother the sunscreen. So we're going to dinner, I'm so excited. Get out of bed? You don't think so? You have a fuzz on your face. You have a fuzzy on your face. Okay. What if we had breakfast? Yeah? You think so? You're so perfect. I love you. Hey everybody, it is Box from the Future editing this vlog and realizing that I did not film an outro. Why is that so hard for me every single week? Anyway, Hope you enjoyed our little trip through some highlights of virtual marathon. Uh, we also had that amazing, amazing dinner at Spirits and Tales. It was so super good. And then Tuesday night we went back to the cage. It finally feels like things are a little bit more like real life again and I'm pretty excited about that. Thank you so, so much for watching. Uh, please subscribe if you are new here. I do publish at least two videos a week, always a plan with me and always a vlog. And my Power Sheets video will be coming out shortly, later this week. I'm going to get back on track with regular posting schedule, but things have just been chaotic time-wise in my life. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe. And as always, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and I will see you in my next video.